try to finish it in one hit if you can. Mm -hmm. If you don't, I'll, after you, a while, I'll ask you if you want to finish the pipe. Mm -hmm. If you can respond, respond. If not, I'll take it as a no. Okay. Yeah, get it all in. It's fluid. You know what I mean? It's it. It's it. It's it. There's nothing but it. Yes. It's self-reflexive code. Yes. Yes. But how does it get to be self-reflexive code? And God, yeah. I love it. He loves me. We're it. Yes. I'm coming down. It's all words now. Yes. But um, it was fluid. It's it's just it's the main line. Whoa. <laughs> but but it's scared going in because you got your cultural imprints and layers and. Mm -hmm. But it's the heart. But the weird thing is, how is it just it? How is it it without not being it? That's the weirdest thing of all. Like, what's the context? Hello again. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. <laughs> it's scared, but it's, it's it. It's it. We killed them all, right? We killed our medicine people for the last five, six hundred years or more. We killed the witches and the warlocks and the herbalists and the plant people. And when uh, the new world went back to the old world and it found indigenous cultures who work with uh, plants that change consciousness, yeah. like the psilocybin mushroom, the San Pedro cactus, things like ayahuasca. We, the, the church, who was the empire going back to those cultures, uh, exterminated the majority of them and subjugated the rest and looked it upon as the work of the devil. So we have essentially a few hundred years of disconnect from the planet and from medicines containing substances which change our relationship to ourselves and to nature. We don't know how old the ego is. But it seems to be that it's a component of the mind that obviously we need. The yeah. ego is a wonderful thing, yeah. except we've, we've, we've misplaced the right relationship with ego. Correct. So when we had an expanded capacity and a more of a cohesive connection with our mind, body and spirit, and then all of a sudden that connection dropped and all we were left with was the mind to survive, to feel safe, to, to feel each other. I mean, survival mechanism kicks in. It's almost as if we have species PTSD. We are one very clever species amongst many and a dwindling many because we're killing them all off. But the ego over successive thousands of years has hoarded, it's taken, it's protected, and it's shut itself off from nature to create culture, which is embedded within nature. And culture is a cult. It's like, it's like a, um, 
it's like a bloom which has gone all across the planet, but it's actually starving all the oxygen, like almost literally, right? It's taking more than it gives back because it no longer feels the connection. It's protecting itself from the reality because of that disconnect. What has created the planetary emergency is us, right? And not the fullness of us, but the wounded us, the traumatic us, the shut off us, the scared us, the us that's got who knows how many atomic nuclear bombs out there with a the finger on the trigger, like that could suicidally imagine doing that. Yeah. I mean, how wounded are we to want to kill ourselves and the planet? And I'm not saying that people have to take these substances. What I'm recognizing from my own journey is that nature is psychedelic. Nature yeah. is sacred. Yes. And we are so disconnected that we think of ourselves as separate from nature that we think we are taking ayahuasca. And we are, <laughs> but we're not separate from the, the planet which creates ayahuasca. Yeah. And so people say like left hand path, right hand path, these things are not good. It's like we have a planetary emergency that we are largely responsible for in our egoic you know, function. Yeah. And time is pretty short, right? Yeah. And so you can get to these spaces of non-dual consciousness and of lowering the ego by meditation, by other practices, by breath work, by tantra, by meditation. And these are wonderful. All paths lead to central source. And the emergency contains within it the emergence. And that's what I believe is happening on the planet at the moment. Okay.